Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Kirsten Elizabeth and I make fashion and lifestyle related content. And as you can see by the title of today's video, I am trying something new. You guys may already know that headband wigs are in. And when I say in, they're in there. And if you're anything like me and you impulsively cut your hair on a random Monday, then these are it. I love this because if you're new to wearing wigs or you get anxiety about the whole gluing things to your head or if you're like me and you have short hair, these are really good. You can literally install this in like five minutes and be on the go. If you're late for work, boom. If you're on Zoom classes like me, boom. I've been looking raggedy, but you best believe my camera is about to be on during these Zoom classes. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I apply my headband wigs and I'm going to show you guys how I accessorize the headband wigs because you can do so much with these things. As always, if you guys like this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Now that I'm done rambling, let's get into today's video. Hey guys, so I am back in PC as ever. Before we get into the install today, I'm going to tell you guys some details about the hair. So this headband wig is from a company called beauty forever this is what the package will look like on the package it says beauty forever for your forever beauty because period and on the back of your box is where you're gonna find your hair care instructions as well as details on how to measure the wig I am NOT as advanced into the wig sector to be measuring my wigs but if you are someone who likes to ensure that the companies are giving you the full length that you paid for then there are details on the back of the box that show you exactly what you need to know so i'm just going to open up this package and show you guys what's in the box i will say that i did take the headband wig out of the box prior to me filming this just so i can ensure that i actually like the wig and i wasn't promoting something that i actually didn't like the first thing that's going to be in your box is of course your wig so it comes in in this white plastic bag which is really good ensures that your hair is protected I know a lot of companies started putting the type of hair the texture the length on a little sticker this company does not so if you're someone who has multiple wigs and you use that method to kind of differentiate between which wigs are which then this is something to take note of but I also think it's a minor detail that wouldn't really determine if you buy from this company or not just something that I noticed this wig is a 20 inch straight headband wig as you guys can see that this is a straight texture it did not say if it was Brazilian Mongolian Peruvian things like that so that may be something to take note of all the website says is that it is straight human hair let's get into the construction as you can see this is a headband that makes it the headband wig it's just this thick headband that's velcroed on so when you put the wig on you're just gonna velcro it onto your head which is really good because these wigs are one size fits all so if you are like me and you have like a small head it's kind of big then this is the perfect wig for you on the inside of the wig it has one one comb here and then one comb at the bottom so this is another way that you can just ensure that the wig is not going to go anywhere what I do wish that I would have seen on this headband wig is two additional combs on the side as you guys can tell I have really short hair so this clip in the back isn't really effective for people with shorter hair but the clip in the front obviously is so if you were looking into a headband wig I would opt to have a headband wig that had combs on the side maybe that's a tip that Beauty Forever will take into account in the future headband wigs but that's something that I noticed when putting the headband on my head in addition to the headband wig you do get some goodies beauty forever includes a wig cap this is just to protect your hair this is just the standard wig cap it's obviously like 10 shades lighter than what I am but you'll see when I apply the wig that you will not see the color or tint of the wig cap it'll be completely disguised you can use any wig cap but this is the wig cap that they provided so as you guys saw the headband was black that came with the headband but of course that can get a little boring so they did send me two headbands to put on top of the headband wig so that I could jazz it up a little bit this one is just this pink navy blue and white striped headband really cute give me summer vibe and then this next one is this red green and kind of like a pastel-y pink color beauty forever was also so sweet to send two additional gifts in their package I'm not sure if this is a promotional because of the holidays Halloween is right around the corner but they did send this masquerade ball mask 
it's this really cute purple detailed mask as well as they also included this really neat hand print clip as you can see it's literally a hand with like blue nail polish I don't plan on wearing this with the wig because I'm not sure exactly how I could wear it but if for some reason you wanted a hand pin then Beauty Forever got you covered. So those are all of the items that were sent to me in addition to my hair. Now we can get into installing. So I have freshly washed hair. What I'm going to do first is of course put on my wig cap that was included in my package. Obviously my hair is really short so there's not much protecting that I have to do. But I'm still going to put the wig cap on. First I'm going to lay down my hair and leave my baby hair because when I put on the wig I do intend on leaving some of my hair out just to make it look more natural and then I'm going to put on the wig. Alright guys, so I've kind of laid my hair down as much as I can. I have a lot of short hair closer to my hairline, so I had to draw my hair up with some edge booster and some got to be glue. I have put all of the little bit of edges that I do have outside of the cap. Now it's time to install the wig. Okay, so this is where we're at now. So what I like to do is I like to leave a little bit of hair in the front exposed. So I'm just going to slide this back a little. If you want to, you can leave it like this. But what I like to do is I like to fold the headband in half because it looks very wiggy right here to me. So I'm just going to take this and fold it to cover that little section of the headband. I'm 5'2", so it comes relatively right above my butt, so it's pretty long. So now what I'm going to do is focus on laying those baby hairs. I feel like if you lay the baby hairs, it makes it look even more natural and just cuter. So I'm going to take my edge booster and my toothbrush and just lay my edges. Alright guys, so as you can see, I have laid my baby hairs. Tell me that this is not cute. Took me five minutes, if that, to put it on. All you really have to worry about is your edges or your leave out. But other than that, it's so cute. So now I'm going to show you guys what it looks like with the headbands that came with the package. And some headbands that I bought from Amazon that I think will look so cute with this headband wig. video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and hit that notification bell next to my name so you can see the next time I post I absolutely love this wig beauty forever did an amazing job on delivering if you didn't know I was bald that this is my hair like it looks so natural so cute if you guys try out the headband wig don't forget to tag me in your pictures because i want to see how you guys wear your headband wigs too i'll also be doing a video on how i style my headband wigs because you can do a lot with these guys if you like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and hit that notification bell next time my name so you can see the next time i post bye